Hey guys, for you, let you know that finally now Google and Samsung have unveiled Android 4.0 and I'm really excited about this operating system. I really wanna have it right now. Google, you take my money. I want Android 4.0. I have a Galaxy S2, but uh, uh, let's hope that it will be here soon on my phone or something because 4.0, it's amazing. So some things, uh, the, the first off, they unveiled this new smartphone that I've already been talking about. The rumors were true about the specs that I made, uh, but I'm gonna talk a little bit about Android 4.0 in this video. Um, so basically Android 4.0, this new one, uh, this new version of Android that is both gingerbread, the smartphone version of Android, uh, and the honeycomb, the tablet version of Android into one operating system. And basically, they did unveil a lot of things. First off, uh, they now have made so you can easily make folders by uh, just drag and drop uh, icons or apps uh, onto another one, uh, just as Apple now have in like iOS. And uh, so they did kind of copy that, but uh, also now when you open up uh, your menu, uh, like the button there in the middle, you will both have a, you will have two tabs, one with widgets, so you easily will be able to um, put out widgets, and then you will have one new tab with all of your apps. Um, and also that was you know pretty cool, customizable launcher. Uh, also, uh, they have made like new cards. Oh my god, there's so many things. Um, but they also made a new thing that iOS, uh, that Apple unveiled with iOS, like when you're in your browser and you want to save a web page for offline, you can go ahead and do so. Same goes with Gmail. You can, you know, save a website or you can save it. Uh, like uh, in Gmail, you can like view all of your last 30 days uh, mail offline. So also that's very, very, very cool. Uh, what else? Yes, they have like re-edited the screenshot feature when you take a screenshot. But uh, I mean, we have been able to take screenshots a lot of times, you know, before. Uh, what else? Yes, you can now have like face recognition in the lock screen to unlock the phone. Uh, and also the lock screen is a little bit redesigned. So uh, now you can quickly take a picture uh, by just unlocking your phone immediately to the camera. So you can quickly take a picture uh, there. And that was kind of cool. Also, what I did love a lot was the new keyboard that have um, it's like a better keyboard and uh, what they also made is better like a recognition of words you can easily add words just by tapping one uh, better copy paste system uh, what else yes you are now in your browser you will be able to have like 16 tabs and you will quickly be able to switch between them by uh, seeing a large thumbnail uh, and that was pretty goddamn insane also now your or Android phone window is going to sync with Google your Google Chrome bookmarks on your gmail account so that is also pretty goddamn cool uh, this new roboto font uh, that will make it look much 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 nicer also what it seems like now is that you can like uh, have a widget uh, on one of your home screens and then when you s change home screens you still have that google widget up there in the top so you quickly be able to search for something uh, also it seems like they improved the voice uh, search so uh, when you when you talk you can you know talk with a couple of um, sentences and it will recognize that uh, and you can you know you still talk and it, it was kind of impressive uh, did miss some words though uh, but yeah what else oh yeah my favorite thing was called Android beam uh, basically this new smartphone that they unveiled this next Nexus phone uh, the Galaxy Nexus have NFT technology and this shows something pretty cool called Android Beam and it works with like any er, any single app. It's kind of like Bluetooth but like much better. So if you have another NFC phone and let's say one of the guys in the Galaxy Nexus is in a app and you say oh I want that app then you can just easily sync your phones in one second and then your phone will go to the Android market and so you don't have to manually go to that website. Also let's say he is on a website that you want Want, you can quickly sync your phones by you know putting the back of the two phones together and then you will have that then your your phone will go to that website and it works with contacts you can sync everything pretty quick you don't have to type in anything manually so yeah but obviously you need NFC on that other phone down as well uh, but uh, yeah I was really exciting there about Android B bad as stuff and uh, yeah so many new things yesterday they copy a little bit iOS and stuff like that and uh, yeah, that, that was kind of hilarious. And they did fail on some things that they were trying to show off. Uh, but also to unlock your phone with uh, 
you know, you're using your camera, that also sounds pretty badass. So, seriously, I want this device! Oh my god! This Android 4.0 ice cream, it's really ice cream. I mean, oh my god. So many new things, so many awesome things. Did you watch the event? Do you have some new favorite features? I have so many good stuff that um, I can go over and stuff but uh, also the pictures you have like a new cool grid uh, when you're showing your pictures you see like large thumbnails and also they obviously they show this off on their new galaxy nexus to have a big large screen uh, but still looked pretty good and then you can sort them off the countries or after people uh, you also have instant upload to google plus if you use that and also you can quickly make panorama pictures um, just by dragging your phone and it made this picture and it was kind of insane uh, actually and also you have like quickly edit thingies uh, maybe that improved that a little bit uh, and also yes my favorite feature here let's see here uh, let's see uh, you can basically see your data usage that's also very very impressive you can see your data usage what programs is using the most mobile data and let's say you have a data limit on let's say one gig a month then you will be able to see how much you've used you can see projections and you can also see what programs is using and you can also set a cap like a limit and you can also like block applications from using your data when they aren't open so they can't use it in the background that was also very 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 impressive I love that feature uh, kind of insane and I love the new keyboard layout that they've edited it and here you can see the new dictionary thing is so you can add things to the dictionary and probably delete also things from the dictionary uh, but it just looks uh, more like slick and uh, better and everything um, so yes really looking forward to this uh, also when you swipe down now from notifications you have larger like thumbnails and you're able to swipe uh, left or right to remove stuff you can that also works with uh, your tab browsing if you want to remove something you swipe left or right or you just click on that X um, so really really love this update and the SDK is well right now on android.com so that's kind of awesome. They didn't though show off like any like themes. Uh, so yeah, any theming uh, if you don't like this. Uh, but seriously, they made it more slick and look better. Um, so yes, really want this right now. It's awesome. It's insane. I want it right now. Also, you can resize widgets. Resize. Uh, so many insane things. So many insane things. So uh, here you also have the new people's hub. Uh, where you quickly be able to see your favorite people and those you contact the most and everything so this is insane this is awesome also when you dial people you see like a big large picture of that person uh, maybe you don't like that but uh, I think it looks kind of badass if you have a large picture um, so yeah do you look forward to this update I think it's pretty badass it's a pretty epic awesome insane update and uh, it was only six months ago they finished uh, another Android version, so go Android! <laughs> yeah, see you.